Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a vlog. It's been a long time. Um, I'm just in the middle of doing my makeup. Hey, it's been a hot minute. It's currently December the 6th and I have not uploaded on this channel in a very long time. You know, life just gets in the way. <laughs> now today I am getting ready to film some reels. But two to film today. I have not been very consistent with my posting of reels. I've just been going through some stuff at the moment. So, and then this week, it's Tuesday today, and then um, we actually have Daisy's second birthday party on Saturday. So we are in the middle of everything. It's also December, so Christmas is coming. So I guess content has changed a lot. <laughs> since I started this little old YouTube channel. And right now it's just like all about TikTok and Reels, like short form video, but this is gonna be an old school long ass vlog. But one of the reasons why I just kind of stopped vlogging is because of the time. Like it actually takes so long to edit a video, especially like the longer it is, cause you have to watch it and then you have to rewatch it and it's just it takes a long time so i just kind of have been doing short form content of reels and stuff this year I've just focused on that so i just uploaded a story to or a couple of stories about my skin to instagram because honestly my skin is looking so fabulous lately especially today like i've hardly got any new pimples it's just like a lot of scarring and i just like shared my little process but I watched a TikTok of someone mentioning that someone else uses head and shoulders and she started doing it and it worked. And like, okay, I've got to try this. So I use head and shoulders as my face wash morning and night. And then I saw another TikTok ages ago about using um, a tin of Nivea cream for moisturizer. And I started doing that and my skin just got even better. I started using this LED face light therapy thing that Kmart sent me and my just it just keeps getting better and I'm like yes finally I've used a lot of stuff over the years and like nothing works for my skin I do have PCOS so like that doesn't help my skin situation or many other situations yeah i just wanted to share that like this has been working for me and then i get like a flood of messages saying oh you should try this you should try this and it's just like i'm not i didn't come on there to tell you that i want suggestions like i came on to tell you what is working for me and i'm actually really happy with it skincare is so hard and it's like so specific to each person and their skin type and their hormones and everything and it's just like I don't know, it's, it's a really hard one, but I'm finally happy with how my skin is doing at this stage. I was so silly the other day. I was working out in the yard and I didn't put sunscreen on and it was so hot and I got so sunburned. Oh my God, it's so bad. I'm hoping that I can film these reels and kind of like hide it or oh, I'm such an idiot. I think in one I've got two sleeveless dresses and then in another one I've got a one shoulder dress. I just, I just didn't even think that, I just didn't even think. Oh, I needed to get new sunscreen for Daisy. I put sunscreen on her the other day and I didn't realize until the end of the day and she looked really pink. She didn't get sunburned but she just looked really pink and I looked at the expiry date and it was expired and I just didn't realize. So go and check your expiry date of your sunscreen. And it's crazy cause like I put sunscreen on my face every day. So my face was fine. It was just like, mm. the weather's been so shitty. It's just like every year you have that one day where you get burned and you just like, you make extra effort to not get burned the rest of the year, but it's like December and we finally have enough nice weather to get burnt. My GHD gone on since I think it was 2011. I got it for a one year anniversary <laughs> in March 2011. And then just a little bit of hair, mascara, my flyaways. 
makes such difference. This is the LED mask that I've been using. I think it's Kalia Skin or something. And it just like, it lights up with all those little lines light up. See, it's so good. And it has three different lights and I use them all. 15 minutes each light. Here's the Christmas tree up. We put that up the other day and I wrapped some Christmas presents yesterday and today. Hey, pet dogs. What's wrong? You want to go play outside? But no one will play with you. Daddy will be out there again soon. While I was decorating the tree, I got this one out for Daisy to decorate. And she actually really enjoyed it until then she didn't and got bored of it. I'll show you our backyard. We got Daisy a playground for her birthday. Oh my gosh, she's obsessed with it. She loves it so much. Um, and her grandparents put in as well for it. Um, but it's just like, we've got the space, like why not? She loves playgrounds. Like she's absolutely obsessed with playgrounds. Like whenever we're driving around and she sees a playground, she'll be like, playground, playground. And the amount of breakdowns we've had over not going to a playground. It's been a while since you guys have probably seen this yard. Um, but yeah, here's Daisy's playground. We got it from Lifespan Kids. And so, we put in chip bark there. I put in this garden bed a few months ago and it's doing really well. I've changed this garden bed so many times, but hopefully this one stays. We've got turf in here and over there as well. That's where we first did it. So this is a week and a half old or something, not even. And then we got this new pad of concrete and we're gonna put a shelter thingy here and put a barbecue there. And yeah, that's how the backyard is looking so far. We have more plans for down here. So here we're gonna put a border here for the chip bark and then we're gonna put some artificial grass here and have a sand pit and then eventually have a trampoline. And then here we'll have grass and a tree. And then over here we'll have these two garden beds. I'm not sure what I'm going to put in them yet. And then we're going to have like a little paved area in the middle. And then stepping stones to go to the paved area. And these two trees are going to be where they're marked there as well. Um, and then this whole area will be stoned apart from the garden beds. And yeah, and we put in these lovely things here as well. They're looking really nice. I think I need to replace some of the petunias. Yeah, like these ones didn't make it. <laughs> and over here is our veggie patch, which we're kind of like, we've got some new things going and got some old things going. They're broad beans up there. And then garlic and onion. I've planted spring onions and we've got some carrots. I don't know how these are doing. We probably need a, oh yeah, yep. They're growing, that's good. Um, so this is the same stone that we'll have in this area over here. So I actually said to Dean, like I wanted it all done for Daisy's party, but because the weather has been so wet the last couple of months, like it hasn't, it's only until now <laughs> he's been able to do everything, um, which is really annoying, but it hopefully will mostly get done, apart from maybe like the grass patch over there or something. And obviously the barbecue area, we're not gonna get that done in time. These are the pavers that are gonna go over there. So they're just from Bunnings. They're like a concrete finish one. I really, really like them, so nice. We've also had to put in like extra drainage here since like all the flooding waters and everything. And here's our man cave, little update. Um, so I don't know at what stage I showed you guys last, but we got the kitchen in. We just need to get the plumber back to install the sink properly and the tiler to do that and take off some of the wrapping. Um, and then we've got the bathroom here, but we just need to get the shower screen, which we're not in a hurry for anyway. Um, but yeah, a little toilet there. Um, Dean's work from home situation and this is overflow of dash mail stuff. So we just need to tidy up this space a bit more for the party. But yeah, we've just got a lot, a lot to do. <laughs> but yeah, it's all finally coming together. Gosh, Daisy loves that playground so much. She's so cute on her. Okay, I am going to go and film this reel. Wish me luck with my sunburn because I don't know what it's going to look like.
Okay, so I just finished filming the second reel. Uh, this is a Portman's one. So this is the last dress. I love it. It's so pretty. I think I did a kind of okay at covering my <laughs> sunburn. I don't know. I kind of tried to hide it with my hair. Um, it is nearly two o'clock and so I'm going to edit these. I did want to film another reel so then I don't have to do one tomorrow. I'm going to do like, what should I wear for Daisy's first, uh, first, second birthday. I'll just quickly film it. It won't take me very long. Um, and then I am going to have some lunch. Okay. I'm all done filming my reels. So now I just need to edit them and I need to send two off for approval. PM already. <gasps> I've not achieved everything that I needed to today. Um, so for Daisy's party, there is a, a theme. It's a Daisy had a little lamb because Daisy's favorite toy is her lammy. I'm not going like too overboard, but I am making these little chocolates that are sheep. It's a sheep. It's not like the only thing I could find, like a little mold of a sheep's face. And I'm going to make cupcakes and the cake will be a sheep. Dean's mum is making that. And my mum is, I'm hoping <laughs> she's making these paper mache sheeps. <laughs> I don't know how they're going to go. Um, we're probably going to run out of time. But with this sheep mold, there's came in a thing of three and there's a cow and a pig and a sheep. So I have to just make one sheep. <laughs> and then let it rest and then you know give it a couple of minutes in the fridge and then do another one and it's so annoying so i'm doing another there's these daisy molds that i've got as well so there'll be sheeps and daisies it's just really frustrating i did white chocolate yesterday and it just takes so long because you have to like wait around for it to like chill in the fridge so i need to go pick up daisy in half an hour so i can only probably make a couple of chocolates in that time i just saw an email come through that i need to reply to and i haven't been able to help dean today he oh my god <gasps> so the rock that we have in the veggie patch area there is no rock available because the quarry's underwater i think that they said and we can't get any until like in the new year <gasps> It's so frustrating because it's just like we're so close to finishing and then that happens. So anyway. Here's how the little molds turn out. Sorry, I've got more chocolate in there. I'm just about to pick up Daisy, but I just wanted to show you them. Okay, we are home and we've just been outside. I actually went to my mum's first um, after daycare and now we're just outside having a play. Hey Jace, how's the swing? Is it good? 
See Daisy. Oh, you want to see Daisy? There you go. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Have you got your hat on? Yeah. Yeah. That's good. And your boots? What have you been doing? Did you go to daycare today? Yeah. Who'd you play with? Lola. Lola? Anyone else? Yeah. Riker. Who? Riker? You want to get out of your swing yet? Wee! Wee! So we got the trees in. This one here is looking really sad. I just gave them a water. Hopefully they come back okay. We've got the sand. Then we've got some gravel for here for the synthetic grass. And Daisy's got some weed mat. Dean's just putting in some irrigation for this area. Nearly done? I'm done. Oh, you're done. Okay. Now we can cook dinner. <laughs> yeah. So Dean is cooking some lamb chops and some skewers on the barbecue and I've just got some veggies for Daisy and we'll have a Caesar salad to go with ours. Hi mommy. Hi babes. Did you want a Caesar salad? What else you got? That's it. Yeah. She didn't want to eat it off the stick, but she'll eat it when it's on the stick. Is that Daisy? <coughs> Say hello. Hello. Daisy, you want to have a look at yourself? You want me to come with you? Let's go. Yeah. That's not your book, that's a postcard. Who's it from? Essie's. Who's it from? Mummy's. No, from Ollie. Who's going to sit in the high chair? Izzy, where is Izzy? I haven't seen her. Where, where is Izzy? Izzy! Izzy! Esme! I don't know where she is, but I haven't seen her for a few days. Mummy get it. Well, Mummy can't get it because she doesn't know where she is. Daisy get it. Yeah, let's go find Izzy. Izzy! Mm -hmm. Is she in the back room? Come on, let's go. Kids. Yo, there she is. She's reading all those books. Yeah. Oh, she doesn't have any clothes on, Daisy. No. Should we go put a dress on her? Yeah. Let's go put Mommy, a... Mommy, help. Okay. Oh. Mommy dropped it. Oh. Okay. We'll put a dress on her. Dance. Oh, you're dancing? <laughs> That's good. Dean, why is this dog sitting over there? He wants her food. Why is she sitting over there though? I don't know. She just wants places to get food. Dress on. Dress on. Yeah, we'll go put a dress on her. Come on. Dan! I'm probably just going to Okay, you go get a dress for Essie. Mummy sit. Yeah, Mummy will sit, but you go pick a dress for her. Mummy sit. Mummy's sitting. Oh, is there? Yeah, you go get a dress for her. Daisy play room. Yes. Oh. <laughs> what you want this one? What color is this? Pink. Pink. That's good. Are you gonna put it on her, or you want mummy to? Dress on. Yeah, good job. That's it. Dress on, Ellie. No bounds. Yeah, good job. Little arms. Yeah. Yeah, put her arms in. Just one at a time. Good job. E. Oh. You nearly had it. Here, try again. Try again. It's 
So you do a backup bag. You put the Velcro together. Oh, really good job, Dace. Oh, well done. Yay, you did it. You say, I did it. I did it. Good job, Daisy. You put a dress on Ezzy. Right, did you want to put her to bed? Because she's going to go nine eyes now. No, it's not fun. Hi. Talk to the camera. Hi. 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 You say, I'm going to have my bath now. Bye. In true vlog form, it's now hours later. It's like 9.30. <laughs> Um, so Dean and I had to go to Bunnings, so Dean's mum came over while Daisy slept, which was really good. We got our artificial grass for like the sandpit area and that's amazing. Um, I only got like eight cheap chocolates made today. <laughs> I meant to do 12. They just take so long. Um, I've just been putting away some washing and I need to go to bed because I'm so tired. <laughs> Um, hope you guys enjoyed today's random vlog and I'll see you next time. Bye.